Deep in the 1920s cell, Emily Hartwood's uncle has gone missing. Together with private investigator Edward Carnby, he embarks on a journey to Sorato Manor, a home for a mentally ill where something is lurking. You'll encounter strange residents, nightmarish realms, dangerous monsters, and ultimately uncover a plot of rising evil. Intersection of reality, mystery, and insanity. An adventure waits that will change your core belief. Who can you trust? What will you believe? And what will you do next? Ooh, okay. Starting off in a bedroom. I've got a kid. I love the music so much. <laughs> Alone in the Dark by Cassandra. I don't, I don't know how to say her second name. Okay. So, we've got a little girl named Cassandra. She likes painting. Doing some art, okay. Why is she biting the lip like that? I don't know. <laughs> ah, yo, maybe she likes a bit more than painting. Huh. I feel like she got an attitude. Yeah, look at her face. She's like, like so scrunched. Oh, we're just in just like that. Okay. Wow. Okay. Why is the sensitivity so high? All right. So here's our little art kit. I can't kit. wait to paint this. Gonna give it a big mustache. Sounds cool, Cassandra. Is that her name, Cassandra? I feel like I've already forgotten. I feel like I'm just gonna start calling her a random name now. Fine. Okay. Winding a creepy little music box. Ugh. Yeah, I don't like- Okay, so this is our bedroom. How you doing, dolls? Yeah, they're freaky. Well, I still don't understand why people keep dolls in their house. I find it so weird. See, this one, this one's like Mega Mart. Obviously, this is set, um, I don't- Like, what was it, 1920s? Which- Oh, is this Not her family? Not my best work, if I'm being honest. Not my best work. There's my family. There's my wheelchair, man. I don't know why I love the vibes of 1920s. It's just so cool to me. Okay. I don't know why there was a crow in the house. All right, what's this? They have those like um sovereign accents as well more paintings naked is that a woman or a guy okay all right okay basically i just i didn't realize that the first time we went through this that door shows like a whole nother dimension when you open it later it's just a bathroom. I didn't even realize. Anyways, like I was saying, I had to quickly reset the game because my audio bugged out. So we're back here. We're just opening the door. And... Oh, goodness. You scared. I don't know who this is, but... What are you up to, Jeremy? I have to tell oh, someone well, Jeremy. what is going on here. I have to try. You're not one of them, are you? Please tell me, Chris. You're not a spy, are you? Who spy? Them. The others. All of them. No. You're too innocent. I'm too innocent. I need to get this letter to my niece. She would understand. Just give it to the clerk, Mr. Waits, and he'll post it. No, he could be in on it. What if he won't post my letter? Then don't make it look like it's one of yours. Here, let me do it. Miss Emily Hartwood, the Fan Street, New Orleans. You don't have the number? I'm not sure the postman's gonna find it without. Jeremy? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? The hell? I'll just post it myself then. Well, something I'll up just to Jeremy. I'll letter downstairs to the clerk's office myself. Uh oh, Cassandra, I'm touching your typewriter. Oh, I'll take this key. Okay, I'll take that. Okay, so that says hallway key. Okay. The first time I went through this, I didn't actually realize that was basically like a whole different dimension. I thought it was just a bathroom door that shut on itself. So like, if we go back in, I don't know. Oh God, that's mice. I already washed my hands today. Cassandra should be more careful with her medicine. Wait, what's the little girl's name? I'm just gonna call her Cassandra. Okay, we're not gonna go back through there. So now that we have the key, we can actually go through the door we couldn't go through earlier. Okay. Okay, this is weird. There's a bunch of mannequins. This is really weird. They're so creepy. Um, <gasps> okay, what? Oh, just happened. No. Jeremy, what have you done? Okay. Jeremy! Okay. 
Okay, so did we just go into like a different dimension? Like I saw earlier in the bathroom door. But like the one earlier in the bathroom door, guys, that looked like sunny. And this one looks more or less like swampy. Like, okay. Oh, okay, so we're gonna- Okay, I don't know what the hell that was. That looked like it was from Stranger Things. Okay, I need the bear. Alright, push. 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 Okay. Jump on the bear. You got that, Susie. Okay. Okay, watch. That big giant whatever that was is in the water. A crocodile. I don't even know what the hell to call it. Ah! Uh, it's under me! It's under me! Jump that! Okay, nice. Okay, let's hurry up because that thing's like right behind us. Yeah, there it is. Oh, there they are. There's multiple. Okay, shut the door. Okay, I don't even know what's going on with hungry, hungry hippos over there. Okay. I suppose this mess pales in comparison to the fort. Okay, someone broke a vase. I don't know why. Was this little radio? Okay, so I think Jeremy might have gotten like caught by whatever those were and taken away. But the thing is, I'm taking it. That's what happened to him. But I don't really know. Okay, we need a key for that door as well. Can't go for there. I do love though the like the 1920s like aesthetic. I love it so much. I don't. I don't know why. Hello. Like I always like games like this. With that. Oh, we're gonna crawl for the window. Okay, we dropped the book. Picked the book up. Oh, why is it so dark? All right, so we delivered it. And there's something in there. Okay, what is that, bro? <laughs> Alone in the dark. <laughs> Yo, that's creepy. My, 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 my window just closed on its own. That's creepy. <laughs> Miss Emily Hartwood. Oh, was that not the letter the little girl was like delivering? Last night I dreamt that my uncle hung himself in the attic. That we were too late. Jody Coleman. The house looked different, but it was still called Dorsetto. Baby. Definitely a weird place. Oh, that's the guy from, before. um... I just can't think why. Stranger Things. Let's not waste any time, detective. Yeah, you're right. Let's go get your uncle, Miss Hartwood. Her uncle. The one on the right definitely looks like a sheriff or some sort of investigator. They wear like the 1920s like uh, clothes. I don't know. That was pretty cool. I like that. Why was it so short though? Uh, anyways, guys, if you guys did enjoy that. Please drop a like and turn the notification bell to get my next upload soon to upload. Yeah, that was actually really, really cool. I can't lie. I want to know what happened to the girl. Like, did she just get eaten? Did she get like turned into one of those things? Maybe they get like turned into more? Uh, yeah, take care of yourself and I'll see you guys in a bit.